What will you have it take? Nothing. I'm just returning from meeting a lot of minds. I mean, I must have woken up a lot of people. Must have broken a lot of dreams. They just dream. You can always go back to them. I say, which one of yours did I break? You really want to know? I was at this big open ground. It was all empty. I started walking and I saw a big fenced area. I kept on walking and I saw some people on the other side of the fence. I knew them. It was like they were calling me. Like I don't deserve to be on this side of the fence. Why do you think you don't deserve it? Well, I don't deserve lots of things. How did you know those people? The ones in our dream? I met them somewhere in my life. Maybe they didn't play an important role, but I just knew them. And where do you think they are now? Probably dead. Dreams are never random. What I do is I try and give them some meaning. I know that there's some guilt. I don't know if it's about those people being on that side of the fence or you being on this side. Tell me something. You're sitting here talking to me. How do you know if it's a dream or reality? Don't tell me you're already high. No, but I mean seriously, when we're dreaming, it's real for us, right? So how do you know the difference? Believe me, I know. You know, I read somewhere that uh, you can't change the exposure of light in dreams. So, if it's a dream and you switch off the light, it won't go off. You can try it if you want. It doesn't matter. Hello? Yes? No, I already have it. Thank you. Who was it? It was the bank for life insurance. You already have it? What? Life insurance. I just said that to get them off my back. You have life insurance. I don't need it. Do you write? Can I read something written by you? I haven't written much. How does it feel? To stop aging? A friend once told me that the meaning of life is that it stops. Kafka. Franz Kafka said that. It's you in all these photos, isn't it? Yeah. China, US, India, Russia. You've been traveling a lot. You didn't ask me how many of these old pictures? 
I know Angal. How do you know my name? I know all your names. Angad, Jinwong, Gregory, Afidel. Do you miss your family? Do you even remember what their faces look like? How do you feel when you see someone you love? Who are you? I'm here to tell you that this horror story is never going to go back to being a love story. Why do our dreams feel so real? Why? Because it's the only trick I played to stay relevant. Otherwise, who cares what they saw when they were asleep? You play? My mother used to call me Sapna. She said I have this unique ability of being with everyone at the same time. So you are with everyone right now? Yeah. You're special. I'm talking to you directly. What? You know how when you're dreaming, there's one person always observing you, not saying anything? That's me. Like I said, I've always been alone. But why are you here and what do you want? That's what I want to ask you. What do you want? What is left to see? Aren't you tired? How many people have you seen dying? How many people have you killed? You've just been running around changing countries. I've dropped you a lot of hints in your dreams, but now I wanted to ask you directly. What is the least powerful thing in the world? You know, I came to know that something is wrong with me. When I turned 40, I looked exactly the same as I did when I was 24. You know, the worst part, I've seen my kids die in front of me. Whenever I fell in love, the first thing that came to my mind was, what will I tell her when she ages and I don't? When she'll take her last breath in my lap, how will I look her in her eyes? And people say, it's just a number. Ask me. I was in China when Japanese killed legs of Chinese people and even raped their women. Measles, plague, smallpox, TB. I thought that I have a disease. But something inspired me to help. You know what? Hope that everything will be fine. Hope that humanity has survived all this. We can together survive whatever comes. Even after years of misery, pain and violence, we still stand hand in hand. We still choose life over death. Death may be the ultimate truth, but I'm not going to...